going on guys? It's your boy Dilly TV guys and I am back with another Madden 23 Ultimate Team video for you guys. As you can see on the screen, Headliners Part 2 in here right now. We have 30 new challenges, you have some new objectives to complete for the field pass. You have to win a game for 20 with 20 headliners on your team for some XP. Um, as you guys can see, I'm not going to read all of it. If you want, you can pause the video and see what's going on. But essentially, just get 20 interceptions um, with in head-to-head -head or solo battles, and you'll get some XP. As well as hold your team, the opponent, under 200 passing yards. You'll get some XP there as well. So right now, all in all, you're looking at about over 15,000 XP for your field pass on the screen right here. So if you want to get that XP, you want to get that uh, level 51 uh, reward, dive right in, get this. Um, this is going to help your team. We're going to go ahead and go over the gold cards and then move our way up to the heroes. So stick around. You guys don't want to miss it. All right, guys, and here are the low goals. You guys can go ahead and pause the video. I'm not going to really go over all of them, but as you can see, that's definitely what you're going to need to put into some sets, honestly, to get uh, the heroes and the 86s and all. So this is the low goals for Headliners Part 2. And here are the higher goals. They literally are 78 to 79 overalls, which you will need to complete some sets. Like I said, if you want to pause the video, see who they are and everything like that, go ahead. Uh, I don't want to spend too much time on these. I just want to spend time on the actual really, really good cards that everybody wants to see. So let's get into these 82 overalls overalls right now all right guys and starting off with the 82 overalls is Asante Samuel Jr a really good D-back really good corner as you can see 82 speed 83 acceleration his man zone is 82 and his zone is an 80 this is a really good third corner or fourth corner if you need it for depth you could definitely plug this guy in if you're no money spent like myself for me I do have more than an 82 uh, overall on my team that's actually pretty good so I will not be putting him on my team I'll just be putting him in sets to get an 86 overall all right guys and our next 82 overall is Jeremia Jeremiah um, I'm not really good with these names so please forgive me but 81 speed 82 acceleration not the best right side right outside linebacker but what you could do with this guy is you definitely definitely could put him on the line and let him blitz as an edge rusher it's something to think about um, that's just all I'm gonna say with him he's not really one of my ideal quarter cards I'm just literally just gonna put him in for a set and guys, we got a Tennessee Titan here as another 82 overall left end. Um, Danico, he's got 75 speed, 77 acceleration, 80 strength, 80 tackle, 81 power move, uh, 70 finesse move. So this is definitely a good card to put in if you need to plug in a tackle or a left end, sorry, excuse me. And this is definitely, definitely somebody that you would want to put on your squad if you're struggling. If you don't have a, an end that you need, you can definitely put him in and it'll definitely contribute to your team. But for me, he's just a little slow. 75 speed just doesn't cut it for my team. And now we're getting to the guys that matter the most, the line. Uh, left guard, Cody, white hair, 82 overall, 79 strength, 80 awareness. He's got some pretty good pass blocking and run blocking. Um, he's definitely somebody that like, if you need an upgrade at left guard, you could stick him in there. He's not the best, but you could stick him in there and he'll do just fine for a no money spent team. Or you can do it like I'm doing and just put him into a set. And here we go, we have quarterback Jared Goff. Honestly, he's my least favorite out of this whole thing, this whole promo. 82 overall, he's got 70 speed, his throw power is 84. It, I mean, honestly, like, I think he's like right there with Joe Burrow. Like, they both are side by side. I think just Joe, Joe Burrow has a better release. Um, so this card I don't want to waste a whole lot of time on because it's just not a really good card. All right, guys, and the, rounding out the 82 overall, we have Reggie Gilliam. A fullback, this is the one that I would probably use in my lineup is this 82 overall fullback. He's got 80 speed, 79 strength. He's got really decently good blocking, 81 run block, which is really, really good. But what I like about him is he has 78 catch. So he's definitely, like his card describes, a utility player. So if I had to put an 82 overall in my squad, this guy right here would definitely, definitely take um, spot on my roster. So that's all of the 82s. Let's go ahead and dive right into the 86 overalls. All right, guys. So now we're getting into the 86 overalls, the set completions. You got starting off with free safety, Eddie Jackson, just a beast. And I think for like the past two Maddens, really, Eddie Jackson's cards have just been really, really good, especially in like Madden 21 and Madden 22. He really shined. As you see, 83 speed, 85 acceleration. His tackling's in the high 70s, so it's definitely, definitely usable. Um, as you can see, he has an 85 pursuit, which is really good. 
82 man coverage and 85 zone and 81 uh, power. Honestly, guys, I would probably use this guy just like I am with my Cam Chancellor at sub linebacker. I'd probably put him at linebacker just because of the power, the 81 power. So if you're thinking about maybe I could use him at like sub linebacker, throw him in there. He'll do define just fine. Plus he has mid zone KO. So putting him at like linebacker and then like some, like a pass coming across the middle, he's probably going to knock it out, honestly. All right, guys, and now we have right outside linebacker Corey Littleton. 80 speed, 81 acceleration, 81 tackle. This is somebody that I would use kind of like what I was talking about earlier. I would just put him at the end and just let him edge rush because he's got that 80 speed. He's got that finesse wood in the 70. So it's definitely a linebacker. If you wanted to put him at end, you wouldn't have a problem. But again, you would just use this guy to put into to get the 89 hero set. And this is the guy that everybody wants from the 86 overalls. You've got Javante Williams, 84 overall speed, 83 acceleration, 80 agility. He's got 86 carry, 80 change of direction, and he has the second highest trucking in the game behind Derrick Henry at 87, and he's got an 85 uh, break tackle. He's got 64 catch, which is okay because he's a power back. But what I like most about this card it's his is his pay, his baked in ability right that guy's his that bulldozer that he's just literally going to get you that one to two yards that you need whenever you're trying to get some short yards so definitely if you're going to pick up any 86 overall card outside of reggie jackson this would be the 86 overall to get all right guys and if you're looking for some linemen don't worry i still got you guys we got right tackle lane johnson as you can see 82 strength 85 awareness He's got some really, really good pass and run blocking. If you're missing a right tackle, and let's say you got like a 78 to an 82 overall right tackle, and you're like, I need to upgrade, think about Lane Johnson. He's got great strength, great awareness, like I said. He's definitely somebody that if you're wanting to upgrade your position, you definitely want to choose Lane Johnson. And rounding them out, guys, we have a, a center at 86 overall, Tyler Shatley. That's right, guys. Tyler Shatley is definitely one of those top centers that you want to have, guys. 86 strength, 85 awareness. Again, everything in the 80s as far as uh, pass and run blocking goes. This is a solid, solid center that you guys can pick up and use at any time, probably until we start getting to like the mid to high 90 overalls. He's going to do the, the trick just fine for your team. So later on in the year, if you want to pick him up, you can. If you want to pick him up now, you can. I definitely will probably pick him up probably later in the year, honestly, uh, as just like a low budget card, honestly. Uh, but that is 86 overall, Tyler Shatley. All right, guys. And as you can see, Javon Holland, 89 overall, free safety, 88 speed, 87 acceleration, 80 tackle. The zones are just insane. Literally, just insane. 87 overall, man, and 89 zone with that 87 power. This is a must-have free safety alongside Ronnie Lott. If you got to pick one of the two, I'm going with Holland just because of his baked-in abilities, but he's definitely can get the job done. You could put him at sub-linebacker. You could put him at free safety. Uh, it's whatever you want to do. Me, if I get him, I'm probably going to put him at safety just because of the 88 speed. So this is the one of the heroes, the 89 overall heroes, is, is Javon Holland, but everybody wants this next hero. Justin Jefferson. This guy is a beast. 88 speed, 89 jumping, 87 catching, 87 catching traffic. Um, you got 89 spec, and then you've got some 87 short, 88 medium, and 89 route uh, deep route running. This card is literally just insane, insane. Probably the best wide receiver outside of Randy Moss. So he will probably stay at that second wide receiver if you have Randy Moss, and or your third uh, wide receiver late in the season as we get these hot, these early 90s, high uh, 90s moving on. Justin Jefferson is going to be that guy. All right, guys, and to finish it off, here we are with my ultimate team. What we're going to do is I got this pack from the field pass right here, guys, this 86 overall headliners hero pack. We're going to open this live right now to see if part two 86 overall headliners are in this pack or if it's just part one. So let's go ahead and find out. We're gonna go ahead and open it up and we're gonna see right here. Let's find out. And you only get the first part of the headliners with this headliners hero pack. So for me guys, I don't need a right, a right outside linebacker. I already got uh, Donald Parham. I don't need him. So I'm probably gonna pick up uh, quit and pay for my line, this is going to be my next right end, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget that like button, guys. Um, as always, guys, this is your boy, Dilly TV. And I'm out. Peace.